In the illustrious arena of the Breeders' Cup, where equine excellence converges from every corner of the world, spanning six continents and embracing over 16 nations, true equestrian champions are anointed across 14 prestigious divisions. Now, allow me to introduce the star of our tale, the formidable Arcangelo. The cast. Jockey. The masterful reinsman aboard this grave phenom is none other than Javier Castellano. Trainer. The reins of Arcangelo's destiny are firmly held by the capable hands of Jenna Antonucci. Owner? Guiding the fortunes of this budding superstar is the Blue Rose Farm. Breeder? The cradle of Arcangelo's lineage is none other than the Don Alberto Corporation. Sire? From the bloodline of the 2016 Grade 1 Breeders' Cup classic victor, Arrogate, emerges our protagonist. Dam. Modeling, by the illustrious Tappet, lends her grace and strength to the lineage. The tale of Arcangelo's meteoric rise to stardom began with a historic triumph, etching his name in the annals of racing history. It was June 10th, and the prestigious Grade 1 Belmont Stakes served as the stage for Arcangelo's coronation. Under the skilled guidance of Javier Castellano, this three-year-old Grey Ridgling seized command as they turned for home in the grueling one-and-a-half-mile test of champions. With unyielding determination, Arcangelo pulled away, crossing the finish line with a one-and-a-half length lead. This victory marked a momentous occasion, for it made Jenna Antonucci the pioneer among female trainers to secure a Triple Crown event. Antonucci's journey to this crowning achievement was no easy feat, as she recounted, you take it on the chin, you fight for that spot, and you feel you have to prove your worth. Horses don't care who you are. They know who you are. The narrative of Arcangelo's ascent was one of resilience. He faced defeat in his initial two outings, only to unveil his prowess with three consecutive triumphs. His journey of redemption commenced with a victory in a Gulfstream Park maiden race in March. A narrow head's breadth secured a win in the Grade 3 Peter Pan at Belmont Park in May. The grand culmination of this remarkable saga unfolded at Belmont, with Arcangelo claiming the prestigious Belmont Stakes. Following his monumental win at Belmont, Arcangelo continued to etch his name in the annals of racing history. In a breathtaking display of prowess, he clinched victory in the Grade 1 Travers by a margin of one length. In doing so, he left luminaries like Kentucky Derby winner Mage, Preakness winner National Treasure, and Champion Forte trailing in his wake. Jenna Antonucci, the guiding force behind Arcangelo's meteoric rise, entrusted this exceptional talent to the nurturing care of the Blue Rose Farm, owned by John Ebert. Remarkably, Ebert's investment in this prodigious equine athlete amounted to a modest $35,000 at the 2021 Keeneland September yearling sales. Thus, Arcangelo, sired by the illustrious Arrogate and born of modeling, herself a descendant of Tappet, proudly carries the legacy of the Don Alberto Corporation in the storied fields of Kentucky, and must not be taken lightly in this classic. Subscribe to our channel now and saddle up for thrilling content that'll get your heart racing. Don't forget to hit that notification bell so you never miss a stride on our equestrian adventures. Let's ride together.